So can you tell me your name and where we are? Uh, my name is Tyler Mitchell. We are at uh, 208 East North Street, Tampa, Florida. Um, this is a site where there was a housing takeover done um, during the beginning of the RNC. Uh, police have showed up and uh, for some reason the people that uh, were living in the house were told to comply and just leave without any real legal standing on the matter. Um, they have the water turned on in their name, they're getting their mail here, their bed is here, they're paying for the utilities. Um, technically at this point it should be a civil matter that you know the, the property owner would have to file an eviction and it would have to go through the courts that way. Um, so I don't really know why uh, they were told to just comply with the police and leave the premises, but that's where we're at now. So it sounds like from a legal standpoint, it was essentially their house. They were living here. They were they yeah. Were... By, by the by the laws in Florida, by the squatter rights, you know, if you have utilities in your name, if you are getting your mail there, if your bed's there, it becomes a civil matter, and you know they have to go through an eviction process to remove you. So now, do you have any idea of what they'll do? I don't know. Uh, one of the people mentioned taking them back to Romneyville, but I don't know what the purpose with that what that would be since Romneyville's uh, closing down, you know, in the next couple days anyway. So. And there's a sign now up on the house that says something to the effect of this building is um, condemned, something to that effect yeah. that it don't come inside. Is there something structurally wrong with the building? <laughs> no, not not whatsoever, actually. Uh, Aside from a little bit of overgrown vegetation outside of the building, it's in good shape. Um, you know, air, air conditioning works, roof, you know, stops the rain from coming in. Uh, it's actually, it looks really nice inside. It's a really nice house, actually. Um, so. Is the owner here? Does the owner, is the owner demanding that they, that it's they leave? A, uh, it's actually owned by one of the banks. Do you know which bank it is offhand? No, uh, it's owned by one of the banks. Um, it was a foreclosed on property. Um, and you know, in, in Tampa area, we have this issue where there's, you know, homeless people are outnumbered by vacant homes, which, you know, really doesn't make a lot of sense. You know, there's all these people homeless and there's all these empty homes. You would think the logical process would be put people in homes. Um, for some reason, the county officials and city officials and state officials don't see it that way. All right, thanks so much for your time.